So Sute Gay Kiro. What are you selling here? Yep, yeah, you're gonna walk away. What's the password? First time here? Sorry, got nothing to sell if you don't know the password. What business do you run here? Merchandise is special. What kind of stores don't carry. Get someone to tell you the password if you want to do business. Well, like I would know. Mm. Good password. I have no leads on where to get it. I guess this will forever be one of life's great mysteries. Now. That guy bought something. He must know, that guy bought something. He must know the password. That That is true. That is how that works. Who are you? You're back. Do you have a little time to talk? All right. Thank you so much. Please come this way. I think I might have helped him. He might have been being attacked. I don't remember him though. Dragon and Tigers, Kamarachu Brent. Oh! Something bore, eh? Owner there has devoted most of his time and energy in the secondary line of business. Now he's instructing me to follow suit. What's the business? Uh... I trust you can keep secret. He deals in weapons and other gear of that sort. Guns, is that it? That's a dangerous trade. He's a weapons enthusiast. Dealing in weapons and other combat gear from all around the world has been a dream of his. I say, I said enthusiast, but his wife would call him a maniac. He's a network of agents that sends him weapons and parts, and he makes his own verses as well. Seems he met an interesting customer recently. Majima. Now, single mindedly pursuing a new goal, which is to provide that unusual customer the finest equipment he can find or make. That is why he's now telling me to sell weapons and gear here as well to get feedback from Kamurochu buyers on usability. Mm. Pretty tall order. Trained to become a chef at this restaurant in Sotenbori, so I was aware of his side business. But that doesn't mean I'm comfortable selling weapons myself. Tell me everything I know, so I'd do anything for him, but this, I'm afraid, I'm afraid of the police and even more afraid of the Yakuza. Just weapons and gear. Any other illegal stuff? No, nothing else. But we would also repair worn down or broken weapons too. When so the Sotenbori branch gets something new, the owner will make replicas so we can offer it here in Kamarochu too. So this is stuff we can do with Majin, or Majima that would affect us here. That's why his skills sales are meager because he's terribly picky about new customers. Which follows the example here. Won't blabbermouth and you'll be in big trouble. You're right. In that case, would you be our first customer? Are you serious? Dead serious. You seem tight-lipped. Having a regular customer like you would come in handy in case we do run into trouble with Yakuza. I don't much fancy being their go-to guy for Yakuza problem, but I might need that sort of equipment. And it's not like there's a lot of shops uh. like this. Fine. It's a deal. I'll come by when I need something. Name's Kiryu. <laughs> Pleasure to make your acquaintance, Kiryu-san. The owner will be delighted when I tell you to tell him the news. You can now purchase, sell, and repair equipment at Dragon and Tiger. I don't think we have a whole lot we can do. Uh, although I do want to go ahead and buy... Let me buy everything that we don't currently have. Just to get this out of the way. There. Yep. And then we're gonna sell some equipment. I'll be honest, I don't like using things. Um, we'll, main, we'll, main, we'll keep the gun. Apply enough force to knock out your average foe. Actually, you know what? no, we'll, I guess we'll keep, well, I'm not full, so we'll keep everything for now. I know there's some, I want to keep everything because of heat moves. There's some heat moves you could probably do with that stuff. Oh, I like the lucky cats. I want a lucky cat. I do, I will say though, I think lucky cat, the lucky cat thing is, is gaudy looking. Normally, because it's always decorative with gold and stuff, but I want a lucky, I want a lucky cat. All right, let's continue with that whole, uh, oh God, why are you like flipping out? There we go. What did you just buy? Oi. Excuse me, you want something? I saw you say saying a password to buy something from that guy. Can I get the password off you? Ah, oh, that's what this is about. I can tell you, but you'd, but you'd be okay. Very dangerous if you know. Is that risky? Of course. Many friends, di many friends died to get a password? What? All in pass. Over now. Actually, you look like strong. Man, maybe you can. Mm. No, no, it's nothing. Anyway, you want password or no? Tell me the password. Sure, tell me the password. I have to know what that guy's peddling. <laughs> I like you, stupid, but I like you. 
Uh, not free. There is a condition. You do job for me. Simple job. Very easy to explain. Now listen. You go to Tai Hai Boulevard East, find restaurant, Yurukutite. In front, find a woman named Mon Mon. Talk to Mon Mon. Okay, two things you ask her. Plans for today and tomorrow's weather. Plans for today and tomorrow's weather. You ask her to come back and tell me what she say. Very simple. Mon Mon, tomorrow, or plans for today, tomorrow's weather. Now, where was this at? No. It was Taiha Boulevard East. Okay, so straight down. Mon Mon, today's plans for today and tomorrow's weather. Oh, this is that, uh, okay. We weren't able to get in here before. No. Her. There's a woman in front of your Kotai. She could be Mamon. The woman I'm supposed to find. To ask her a couple things to get the password. Oi. Are you Mon Mon? I not know you. What you want? A couple things I need to ask you. Yeah? What do you want to know? Uh, plans for today and tomorrow's weather. Can you tell me about your plans for today and tomorrow's weather? Oh, I see. Waiting for this. You want to answer. Then? You fight first. Really? This isn't what I signed up for. I mean, he said people died for this knowledge, so something was going to happen. Oh, this is the Mafia. We actually don't have much experience in the Mafia, do we? Throw you. Ow. I don't suppose you'll throw him into the other guy, would you? Ah, uh, that'd be too convenient. <laughs> you very strong. You pass tests. I give you information, tough guy. Good. Plus today are a movie date, rain at noon. Lai Loon for me. Man who sends you here, sneaky man, usually near shopping area. Lai Loon, tough boss for work for. Not so easy for you. He's not my boss or anything. I disagree. You not have to keep secret from me. What are you talking about? Very good. You good acting. Lai Loon, the clever man. I always find good people work for him. Uh, plans for today was movie, tomorrow's weather was rain at noon. Oh. Why would you attack me? You're just gonna lose all your money. Ooh. Nope, turn around, there you go. Yeah, you get a whole lot less money if you don't, uh, do a heat move on them. What was it? Uh, something out of a movie and rain at noon. Uh, I don't get what it means, but I got our answer. Uh, movie date. Set a movie date. Rain at noon. Good work. You bring me Momo and answers. Big help. You didn't tell me anything about a fight. All part of the job. That's why I asked you for it in the first place. Quite useful man. I impressed. By the way, what was that about? You think I'd tell you? No chance. Code words for next business deal. So some shady deal after all. I figured those phrases shouldn't be taken from face value. All right. What's the password? Patience. I finished deal first. You walk around and wait for me. <laughs> or we just sit here and smoke. Mm hmm. How's your deal go? Big business will go through, thanks to you. This thanks to you for... Got a broken M1985? About that password. I know, I not forget. I tell you, you listen careful now. 
Subo Ten New New Hi Gay Kidro. Nani? Problem? You see what I mean when you tell me merchant man. Yeah, um, can you say it one more time? You listen careful, okay? Subo Ten Uhai Kidro. Remember I say you say Pastor Merchant Man, I hear it for a while. I figure okay. Okay, cool. So we can always come back and ask. Uh, oh god, they're not going to make me spell it, are they? I didn't think about that. If they make me spell it, I'm screwed. Well, if they make me spell it, I'm going to have to I'll write it down. Or take a picture of it. What a buy. Say the password. No! Oh, oh wait. Sue Ben... Hi, gay Kiro. I think that was it. I don't remember the. Oh. I can't believe they make you spell it. Ah. Oh. I had to be close. I wonder where I messed up at. I'm gonna take a picture, but I'm, I'm gonna try to do it without looking. But I just—I don't want this to take forever either. Subotin. Oh yeah, I, I messed that up completely. All right, Subotin. Ooh hi. Oh, I got the good gay kiddo right. Subotin. Ooh hi. Good kiddo. I think I got it this time. All right, so it's Subo Ten U I G Kiro. I'm probably not even saying that right. Ah, got it. Cool. Let's close my camera. I didn't have the picture up. Just the camera still. Why are we walking away? What? Huh, finally managed to get the password right. Didn't expect to become a go-between for a shady deal to have to get it, but it turned out alright. Well, it worked justified my curiosity. Mm -hmm. hmm, I wonder if I might have forgotten. Hey, aren't you buying anything? Oh. We literally just... <laughs> I'm curious what... Is he gone? Okay, no. Let's see what he sells. I'm halfway expecting it to be... Actually, I wasn't halfway expecting... I expected this stuff to be here. Metal jacket. Black belt. Ghost koi. Oh, I can buy fish, too. I don't think I need that, though. Well. Okay. I actually was not expecting the equipment part of it. I was kind of expecting the uh, car parts, actually. As weird as that sounds. Uh, we're going to give these fish to the shop, or the... Uh... What, do we, what do we have left? <gasps> okay, the mushroom guy's back. We need to do that at some point. Uh, we need to race her, which I'll probably do later. Um, coming down here. Oh my god. Wait. Oh, that's where you're at. Coming right... Oh, I need to go over here. That place. Give him the fish. And then when we come back, we'll do the reporter guy. God, so much to do. So little time. Oh, oh, pardon me. So a little room to run. I apologize for running into y'all, as I'm guaranteed, guaranteed that I'm going to do. Let's get the fish that we got. Get fish. Sure. Perfect, this will really help me. I'll prepare it right away. 
Build this up on health. How's it, Kirikun? It's good. I feel like working with fresh caught fish will like this will really help me grow. But I could help. If you go fishing again, please bring me a catch. Oh, so I think we just have to bring him fish we catch. That was also a really expensive fish. I need to I need to sell something. I guess being that I can buy all that stuff, I should probably um I should probably sell all the weapons I have. If I don't need them, might as well just sell them. Um, I don't really know a good way to use them. Oh, one of the tips for the bridge thing where you had to defend the guy was to um, use a weapon, like a gun or something. Literally every time the enemy spawned, you had to re-equip the gun. By the time I got the get it equipped, they were already at him, hitting him. And I couldn't do anything about it. It's like, oh my god. That was the worst thing ever. He's he's working with some really rare fish here, and I don't think he realizes it. Especially good today. Sorry, I was so good, I was lost for words. You're making real progress, Genji. Your sushi's getting better every time I come. Appreciate the encouragement. I'm still nowhere near as good as my old man sushi. I mean, it, I mean it, Genji. It's time you had some confidence in your own skills. Believe in yourself. Uh, you keep comparing your sushi to what your dad made. I can understand how you wish you were just as good as Master Chef with decades of experience under his belt, but that comparison is not fair to you. If you let that comparison hurt your self-confidence, you're just going to hold yourself back. Let yourself walk your own path and make sushi the way you want. My dad passed away, and the restaurant dropped into my lap. I didn't feel ready. Not a day passed without nagging thoughts that maybe it wasn't right for a greenhorn like me to be serving customers. I feel like what you just said finally dispelled those worries. It's such a weight off my shoulders. I'll follow your advice to find my own path to create the best sushi I can make. Can't wait for you to have to try it, Kiryu-kun. Come back soon. I almost thought it was going to be maxed out. Um, Maybe if we go back in... I'm just going to go back in. Maybe he's uh, got something for me. This is really good. It's the best sushi I've ever had. Probably a restaurant critic. Huh, glad you like it. I've been to many restaurants, but your sushi is truly exceptional. I've never had anything like it. Put a refreshingly new twist on a classic sushi. Well done. It's full of praise. So, what's your secret? How do you make sushi that feels traditional and novel at the same time? Hmm, well, I'm just following advice from a very insightful person. He told me to believe in myself. Right, kiryu -san? Hey, don't drag me into this. Oh, are you by any chance the sushi master he was talking about? <laughs> no, you got the wrong idea. See, see, see what you got me into, Genji. Ha 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 ha! Knee slappers. Um, I might get this restaurant as one of my uh, places that makes money. Oh, let's sit a little more straight, shall we? Ah, oh, sorry for bringing this up out of the blue, but do you work in real estate? I'm friends with the manager at Urizaki, actually. He said businesses have been much better since you started managing property for him. I assume that maybe you could do the same for me. Absolutely, it's getting harder and harder to do business here with all these tycoons. Yay, so we get we get we acquired this place. Oh, he's another one, Loser King. You got the Sea Master. Oh, cool. Alright, leave. It's like, I think I got like four fishing poles now. Alright, now that I have, have everything in my inventory, let's go sell. Oh god, I have to sell at both places, don't I? Oh boy. I'm also on the wrong side of everything to try and sell. That's okay. No, you're right in front of my... Arr! It's not like, it's not like there was even a way around them. At least not that would been that wouldn't have been so time consuming. Come here. We're gonna take out some of your mates. <sighs> They're all still left, that's what's annoying. There we go. Just go down already. No, nothing but chump change.
Ah, fortune teller lady. Oh, hey, you're the fortune teller. Oh, you want something? Let's just say if I brought us together, I've foreseen myself helping you with business. She's double on stars. With my powers of prog er, prognostication, <laughs> there's no question that your fortunes will be soon looking up. Who's the other guy? Oh, it's the shady business guy. I don't want any trouble. You're a man that gets things done. You help me with more deals. I know you say that, but no, I do not give up. If I help, you will change mine someday, uh, so I help with your business. He is a... Oh, I... Sorry. Hey, I heard all that. Or uh, You know I heard all that, right? Well, whatever. Anyone else around here? Okay, no. Yeah, that's how a few of them were. They just hung out right there outside my place. And we just recruited them. Oh, uh, why am I not collecting? Oh, I did it again. Oh well. Who has the best for food? It's you. <laughs> Straight to B. That's hilarious. Um. Wait, why? I thought I, I thought I sent these out. Yeah, how did I manage to not? How did I do that? Idiot. It's fine. A lot of money I'm getting from these places already. So expensive. Ugh. Well, I still don't have anyone that's like perfect at art. Change the staff, don't we? Yeah, we do. We'd be good. There we go. So, what did it. Hang on. Let me go to my staff list here. Okay. Fortune Teller's an advisor. Which kind of makes sense. Uh, Li Lung is a guard. A terrible guard. I do good. What? Minus two, minus two, minus two, and then four. Why would I want that? I wonder if I can get rid of... Seeing as no one challenges me, I wonder if I can get rid of the guard on the places I own. Wrong way. So what do we got now? What do we still have? I know we still have the racing. That's the right here. We still have... Oh, the mushroom guy's up. And we still have this area here. Okay. But we also need to sell, because I have too much equipment on me. And unfortunately, the only way to sell equipment is to go back to the Dragon and Tiger. So I will also go by the um, pawn shop first, because I think my inventory is kind of full, too. <sighs> nope, that's a trap. Oh, no, it got stopped by a traffic cone. In here, real quick, see how much CP we have. I'm looking forward to getting back to Majima. We're gonna get everything. Get quick change clothes. Nice. Oh, how much did I have? I didn't even pay attention. I just bought it. We have three more. That last one is 40. Last one of that was only 20, I think. That was 20. I know these weren't very expensive. Yes, yes. Pardon me, y'all are in the way. I should have sold. I just should have sold all my weapons that I had when I was at the place. Oh, there is. Oh yes. Oh come on, no, buy this. Stop that. Oh, uh, these places are expensive, though. I 
Pleasure King is not going to be happy about that, though. Uh, sell items, actually. Um, don't need that. Don't need that. Don't need the mushrooms. I thought I could sell other stuff here. No. Hmm. Oh, uh, let me look at... We, had, we got some gear, didn't we? Let me look at that stuff real quick. Um, equipment, yep. I'm curious about this. Really? I honestly thought that was going to be better. That's hilarious. Alright, so I can sell all this stuff. Diving in it may cause collateral damage to others. Hmm. Ooh, pardon me. Y'all are in the way! Move! Oh my god, there's so many... A million yen? You weren't a million yen just a minute ago, were you? Do these prices change? Ultra Godspeed. Nice. I'm almost done with my my car parts. Actually, speaking of which... Components. So we're missing two frames. Looks like we have all... No, excuse me, two... Uh, Whatever you want to call these bodies. We have all the frames. I have all the motors. Missing two tires. And two gears and stabilizers and suspension. Some of that might might be unlocked whenever I finish up the races. Oh, it's Mr. Libido. Screwed up. What's wrong? You seem a little down. Oh, hey. Well, I went to a no-touching bikini bar and I reached out and touched the dancer. So you got kicked out? I just couldn't help myself. Self-control isn't one of your strengths. That is not okay. Are you getting any lately? That's not what I'm here for. Not everyone's like you. Kidding? What are you doing in Kamarocho, the land of sexy ladies? Duh. Let's see. For example, there's a girl at a karaoke bar around here. She's not only beautiful, she's a fabulous singer. I want to duet with her, alright? Maybe I'll look for her if I feel like it. What wouldn't I give to get my hands on a video of a girl like her? I'd keep it under lock and key and treasure it forever and ever. Um, the guy in Majima section said the same thing. What's that about? Where was I heading? Um, here. Remember, he wanted somebody at the karaoke bar. I didn't really understand at the time what that meant. Actually, I still don't. I don't know. Because I went to the karaoke bar, there was no one. She wasn't there. Maybe eventually I'll figure out what... Well, eventually I will figure out what what to do. Even if I have to look it up in the end. Um, not my preferred method of doing things, but if I... I, I want to try and get everything, so... I'm literally going to sell everything, because I don't want a full... Inventory. Uh, keep that one. Get rid of the magazine. Comfy shoes. Protective amulet. Metal jacket. Black belts. Don't need the binding of the sarong or the baseball shirt or the wild shirt now. Secret wallet. We'll keep the Mew shoes and the security wallet. Get rid of one sacrifice stone. Wait. Oh, I own two. Okay, I understand now. Keep that. Necklace, shoes, and keep that. Shatters. The stone gives you strength to endure one critical day. Yeah, I don't care about that. I'm. I don't like relying on stuff that, like stuff like that, in the first place. Okay. Oop. Sorry. I'm going to. I'm going to go into this menu. So we should be organized, right? There's that. I don't have anything in this one anymore. Okay, we're good. It has been dead today. I've had no one stop by. Uh, well, there are a couple people who are here in the morning, and then everyone's just disappeared.
All right. Um, so we're heading back down this way now. Hopefully, Yakuza is not pushing people away. Um, we'll see. I know Saturday is definitely not the busy day for me, though. Why'd you run into me, dude? Alright, so we have two things here. We have the bar here, which I will do on my off time. It's so awkward just sitting there with the woman on the screen like like, like it is for so long. Yep, there he is. Let's see he's alive. Oi. Hey, Kasuga. Kyudrikun, what happened to you? R run. Come on, let's get you out of here. Little weasel. Look how far he ran. Who are you? Hand over that rodent reporter. He's the guy who was talking with Kasuga before. Is he the human trafficking ring? Yeah. Sorry, I can't do that. He's an associate of mine. You're his friend, are you? Then you should know. This town's dark secrets are best left in the shadows. I don't care who uh, I don't care who you clowns are. I just know your boy came here sniffing sniffing us out. For that, you're both going to get the auction. What? be a trash can. Oh, oh no, I lost my trash can. Wait, why am I giving like a purple aura? Or did he have the purple aura for a second? Oh no, he is. What are you doing? Why are you doing that? Why was his dodge like that? Was that a quick step? I do, I'm not injured at all, dude. You're not half bad, but not good enough. Too bad for you, the cavalry's coming. Let's see how long you can hold out against my backup with a rat to babysit. What's going on here? The voice, boss man? Why would you come here yourself, boss? I'm sorry, sir. I'll take care of these two right away, but please, I beg your pardon. You may release them, you're free to go. These pieces came looking for a fight. Any ordinary citizens, nothing more. Just a little overly curious, I'm sure. They know everything. And what of it? You're as much to blame for trying to conduct business with a civilian. Some secrets are best left in the shadows. Uh, I'm sorry, sir. I'll let them go. That man. We're safe? That's worrisome. Save me again, Kiryu-kun. Thanks. If it weren't for you, I'd be merchandise of the human trafficking ring. Better take the lesson to heart, Kasuga. If you sniff around here, uh, if you sniff around when you smell trouble, it'll bite you on the nose. Yeah, no. You've hauled me out of some deep uh, deep stuff twice now. Seriously, Kiryu-kun, I'm sorry. It must have been over my head after all. I'll stop sticking my nose into Kamarucha's shadows for the time being. Who we'll here's a while. If you still want to chase the city's shadows after the heat's died down, be more careful next time. Sounds that there's a sound idea. Maybe I'll lay low. You can laugh now, but if man hadn't shown up, we would have been—we could have been in a world of pain. Not that I know. I was out cold, but you saw the boss of the human trafficking ring, yeah? I ain't to be you, man. I had a glimpse when he hid his identity under a hat. Even if I saw him again, I wouldn't recognize his face. That's still a massive coup. We're talking about a guy who might control part of Karmarch's underworld. Someone big. <laughs> Dream on. Boss voice and stature. I can't shake the feeling I might know him from somewhere. Mystery mounts and trafficking terror as the ring's green litter but right behind you? What did I say about cooling your heels? So much for learning your lesson. <laughs> Call an occupational hazard. Guess just just who you are, Kasuga. Let's see you two drink together again. It's true. Uh, Barkeeper's worried about you too. Oh, is that right? Thanks for your best. Thanks. You're the best. Very happy to hear that, but if I may, you must be more cautious around these parts after all. They say some dark secrets are best left in the shadows. Something matter, sir? No, no, it's nothing. It was the bartender all along. I don't think he'd be in here. I didn't think so. All right, so where are we at now? Uh, I think all we really have left to do currently is doing some more stuff with the businesses which actually 
I think I'm going to start buying up. I'm surprised I haven't been approached by the Pleasure King yet, though next time I go into the office, we probably will be. Um, we'll buy some of these stuff in um, this area. Uh, entertainment. So it's, I think that's up here. I think it's it's a huge, or it's a lot of big buildings in this area. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. So it shouldn't be too hard to find stuff, I don't think. And we get candy. Eat five. Really? Oh, because I never buy food items. Right. Huh. These places have got to be pretty expensive. Hmm. Something three. Curious what that is. Oh, you can go in here. Oh, well, that's as far as you can go. Never mind. Can you go up here? No. Jeez, what can I buy here? What businesses can I buy? Actually, how... What am I doing on money? I can go down here? Oh. Whoa. That's going to be something later. Hey, I, I've kind of found that they don't let you just go into places all willy-nilly. If you can go in there, there's a reason. I don't think... I don't think the area up here is part of it, but we can check. Uh, which one was this one? It's not the, so you had the gambling, you had the pleasure, electronics. Is this one entertainment? Is that what his name was? Oh my god, is there something to buy someplace? Uh, I wonder if I could... Uh, I don't think it'd be that I can't buy them until... Ooh, that might be a possibility. Maybe I can't buy it until after I've beaten the next one. I didn't think that was a thing. Oh, no, here we go. No. Not right now. Jesus. Okay, uh, I need to make some money before we do this. You know, I, I kind of guessed that, though. Um, oh, hello. Um, I figured this one, I noticed that they keep going up in price. Come on. Let's see, for example, this girl at Telephone Club sounds really flirty. I'd do anything to date with a girl like her. Ah, uh, well, I don't know what that's about. No, 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 no. Oh. Get out of here. I don't want to deal with y'all. All right. You're mine. I should finish everyone off here. I've already hurt them all, so. Really? Oh my lord! Jesus! Uh, so let's go back to our office, I guess. I was not expecting to be that expensive, though. Um. Yeah. We should we should hear from the pleasure pleasure king. I think when we go back in here. Oh hey, it's you. Figured you'd join us. He is a manager. I know I, I know I clicked through that pretty quickly. Sorry about that, but wasn't too terribly interested in hearing the uh, responses. Write a postcard. Oh, finally, we can write something new. We can probably write a few ones, actually. Oh, my lord, so many. All right, about the fortune teller who's never wrong. Boy.
Oh my god, 70 million. We're up to 70 million in the uh, last one there. are all maxed out. Okay, cool. Um, oh, we need to change. Staff here. Now we're good to go. 70 million. Wow. It means I can go over there and buy one of, the, one of his businesses and start working on his. You protected your properties. Yeah, there's no way we're not going to hear from her. Oh, no, I'm not going to have enough. Because I'm going to do this. Dang it. Jesus. If I wasn't trying to max these out, I'd have enough, but... Might as well spend everything we got on it. First S rank here. Oh my god, that was so little. Oh boy. Um, one and one. Okay, y'all are right, right, right now. Okay, I've already done that. Let's put somebody here. That's fine. Fine too. I thought... There, that's fine. Uh, I don't have the money to buy anything now. That's because we were trying to upgrade stuff. Oh, what do you know? What's the matter? You look upset. I'm disappointed in you, huh? Never thought you'd be the kind of person who'd go to those kind of places, Mr. Boy. President. Hey, hold your horses. What the heck are you talking about? Well, just look at this. It's a coupon. For an adult shop? Dear valued customers, show our appreciation for your repeated patronage. We'd like to offer you our services for absolutely free. Please drop by the shop with this postcard to redeem you this exclusive offer. Hey, wow. <laughs> you, you go to these kind of places so often they're giving you loyalty rewards? Uh, no, that's not me. Well, at least I've never been to that shop. Then why'd you get this postcard? And wait, are you saying you've been to other places? I don't, I don't know what to think. Hey, don't judge. Besides, are you sure it's really addressed to me? You sure it's not for Yaman Yamanoi-san? Whoa, don't drag me into this. Yeah. Uh, it's gotta be for you. It's in there to our... Huh? It's addressed to me? See, I knew it. But the cinder is the Pleasure King. Pleasure King is challenging you. Most likely, yeah. Taking over a bunch of properties. It's Pleasure King's territory already. Makes sense. As gangs of hooligans under his girl, you should be careful if you're going to face yeah. him. Thanks for the heads up. This adult shop is on Sinryu Avenue. I'll go check it out. Oh, come on. You know that's not why I'm doing it. Pleasure King wants to, to see me. I should head over to Sinryu Avenue. Off to fight the Pleasure King! Well, no, this is the challenge. I wonder what... I don't know which one. I don't know what the uh, challenge will be. So... Sinryu Avenue. So somewhere along here, probably... Probably that. Oh, is it going to be... Oh, don't be shogi. Oh, no. Well, no, no. It said at a, uh... No, she she was skeptical of the place we're going to, so it's got to be the other place. She wouldn't be skeptical of shogi. Oh, I guess it could be gambling. I don't know. I wish I knew ga I wish I knew shogi. No, and there's a gambling king, so it's not shogi. Um... Hmm... I'm almost upset that you have to know Shogi in order to do that mini game. Even if it's just a basic understanding of Shogi, I don't even have that. All I can basically do is blindly hope to fall into a strategy at some point. Um. No, like I said, it's probably this place here. Oh, there she is. Hmm, is that? It was so awful. Oh, honey, I know how you feel. I realize it was hard on you, but you know, 
You really can't deny your customer like that. If you quit now, all your hard work will be for nothing. It'll be okay. Nothing bad will happen. Leave it to me, honey. You trust me, don't you? Of course. I've never been able to trust anyone else in this business, but I trust you like an older sister. <laughs> then you do what Big Seth says, okay? Just hang in there a little bit more for me. Thanks for looking out for me. I'll work even harder. Oh. What a basic... <laughs> what? Living out a customer's little fetish like that. Jaguar Chan. I think it's about time we offered that little tuna to the usual fish market. To them? Don't you think it might be a bit too soon for that? If that hussy's getting huffy over a little thing like that, we can't expect to make much of an offer in the future. Besides, she worked enough to pay back her debt, and then some. She might realize it soon, so now's the time to do it. <laughs> we're so stupid. And the men who spend big money on them are equally stupid. I suppose in the end, they're all just idiots eating eat each other out. Hmm, so that's how this goes. Oh my, if it isn't Kiryu-chan. You naughty boy, you should have let me know you were here. So, did you come to have fun? Our free coupon got your attention, did it? Big boy with a health healthy appetite, after all. No, that's not it. You're the one who called me out here. Oh, now that you mention it, you're right. I absolutely forgot about that, silly me. Won't you play a little game with me? You took on the Leisure King in karaoke battle, right? I want some one-on-one -on -one time with you, too. Let's see, we're all adults here, so we can make it something fun. Let's make a telephone club battle. If you manage to score a date with a girl within three minutes, you win. Oh, I can do that pretty easily, actually. Of course, if you win, you get a slice of my property pie. You run these places, isn't there going to be some kind of catch? I'm not going to do anything shady, that's the tea for truth. The game's no fun if you cheat, don't you trust me? We use the Telltale Boys Club. I'm not involved in the management there, so the battle will be fair and square. Let's do this. Oh, I, we can do this. In fact, I just showed you, which now I really regret showing you because now we're doing it again. Nah. Let's get it. Let's get it on, honey. I win if I score a date with a girl in three minutes, right? <laughs> That's right. <laughs> Don't judge a book by its cover. <sighs> I've shown this too many times. Oh, they assumed you haven't done it yet. I wish I had played the racing mini game more. I was not expecting that to be the uh, the one from the kid. Oh, I got gypped. I'm barely legal. Oh. I, I do think Kiryu is a little older, so when she says that, I'm like, uh, mean and muscular. Lean and molecular. Lean and muscular. I, I forget that he's only 20. Come on. You just might be my type. Describe your body. <sighs> On the one hand, I'm like, man, this would never be real. But I guess that's the whole point of these places. So the girls calling in are expecting this already? I can't imagine girls calling into a place like this, though. God, I hate this so much. Uh... Easy to talk to. <gasps> no! Oh. Shenanigans. Sure, shenanigans. Thank you again. I think I could with you. I do need to be a little careful. I don't know how many... Uh, you're my... I'm popular. Wait. Let's say something nice. You're popular? That's a nice thing to say? I mean, I guess. Twelve, twenty, twenty, uh, it's twelve there, or twenty. Might as well be twelve. Based off these mini games. 
I really want to say 12. Yes, I know which one I need to hit. Get 70 out of my face. What's your face like? Could you imagine describing your face to somebody? It's kind of awkward describing your body as it is. I mean, again, I realize that, that the idea of this teleclub thing is to you're expecting this, but... Ah, uh, getting old, getting annoying, getting along. Kind of a weird thing to say, but okay. Oh, you! S oh my god, I hate this! I hate this thing so much. There we go. We're really getting along. I'm nauseous. I'm nervous. I think we only what is it just one more time or two more? That looks like just one more. And then sometimes it just happens like that. You wanna keep talking to yourself too? That's weird. Can we meet? Oh, and I can't. Now we do this awkward thing again. It's a weird, like physically, her position is kind of weird. How she's positioning herself. Oh, so creepy. It makes me think of the uh, smiles at the end of Silent Hill. When they're doing like the uh, character, like, hey, this character, this character, this character. They do that with her toothy smile thing. Who's life? Oh, Glow is life. Or he was life. Oh, maybe not anymore. Sorry about that. Oh, honey, I should have known you'd get around. You were fabulous. Wait. How do you know how the conversation went? Yeah. Ugh. How can that be? The voice was completely different. It's easy for me to change my voice like that. But your seduction technique was so fierce, you really turned me on. Blech. Never gonna make this mistake again. We had a little fun, and I'll give you a share of my area as promised. Nice. I won, but somehow I feel like I lost. Oh, I managed to close the gap with me again? I better get serious pretty soon. You, oh, really? Really. Be a dear and take care of him, would you? You haven't taken advantage of our absolutely free service offer yet, right? It's my present for you, honey. Don't forget, I'm not going to let you off that so easy next time. So, what's the point of doing the longer phone calls? He's down. Oh, I haven't even used a uh, heat move, have I? Ouch. Definitely just shattered his spine. Sorry about that. Don't worry. I'll never come back to a place like this. More tough and cold blooded than I thought. I'll have to face him in battle soon. Not gonna be easy. No, it's probably not. Wait, what's sound by S? What is that? Is that a shakedown? No. What is this? 
The hooligans are making problems in this area. Should I deal with them now? Aren't you that guy from the Yamanoi's place? Causing trouble here. I'm going to need you to stop. Pleasure King's gig. We're not going to take any shade from the ugly mug. Hustle, hustle out of here. What? Th that's a thing? Jesus. <laughs> they crumpled, didn't they? Come work to real estate royal. The problem the problem in the Pleasure King area has been solved. Oh, I did we did see that, didn't we? When we first started. It was solved the problem. Now all I have to do is wait for profits to come turning back on. We we did see something about that. This is the first time it's come up. So when there's a problem, you, you have to come over here and fix it. Or wh wherever the place might be. To continue getting profits. Oh, I wish it was I wish it would show me where the place places are. I, I, I just want to know which ones I don't own yet. Or, I want to know where... Actually, no. I want to know where they all are. That's what I mean. But there's so many places, and they're not marked in any ma any manner. I well, don't want to go that way, then. And then I have to deal with these guys, like, chasing me every five minutes. I'm just trying to look for the shops. Oh my god, dude. Go away. Mm. I'm looking. Is that, I mean, obviously we don't. We, there's no way we own everything. <sighs> I'm gonna have to look more thoroughly at later. Um. I'm actually gonna walk away because I do not feel like dealing with these. I'm tired of that, and I just want to get these last buildings. Mega Drive stuff toy. I don't know. In fact, I'm still missing some of the uh, electronics one as well. I swear. Yep, there's some thugs. Run away because I don't feel like dealing with you. If I could upgrade them, or excuse me, if I could get by those last ones, would be good to go.